this is uh, Grey Cubes. It's a uh, a breakout cell game. I'm fairly sure it was designed with a uh, mobile in mind. Um, I've been playing it for a bit. It's on sale at the minute, which is why I bought it. I've, I've played it quite a bit. Oh, 45 minutes. Um, we'll just pick a level at random and uh, you can see what it's like. So it's breakout, except, uh, you know, it's in a 2D plane. But it has actual, actual 3D physics, as far as the blocks are concerned. Now the way it works is, uh, the blue box, the blue box, I think, need to, uh, need to be hit once until they're silver and then you get you know like Arkanoid which is a game I loved I really loved Arkanoid a lot on my Amiga like Arkanoid there's power ups that drop down the um, drop down this the screen Ooh. See at the minute I've got four lives. Oh, that's a good one. See the blocks can actually drop off the screen there if you hit them hard enough. So up there at the uh, the top right. You'll see there's uh, four dots, which are my lives. The music is this very uh, sort of weird ambient, ambient soundtrack thing, which is a bit, a bit on the dull side. There are plenty of. There we go. keeps popping up these things about achievements that you can't actually read what it says anything about it it says progress and then doesn't so that's that's quite annoying oh there we go I can read these ones look hooked on 68 fanatic so like I said I've played it for about 45 minutes I find it quite entertaining it's uh, definitely something I'll, I'll you know I'll play casually Every now and again, I think when, when I did now, this is an interesting level. See, it's actually wider than the screen. But there's a wall in the way, you can't get past the wall at the minute. So, until you've defeated these blocks, that wall's in place. So yeah, although it is it is a uh, you know very obvious influences of uh, Arkanoid in the um, before that breakout Atari classics, there is some uh, interesting uh, interesting wrinkles, and uh, yeah, I expect to be picking this up every now and again for a little casual play. I guess about 45 minutes I played before. The wall didn't go down fast enough for me. I uh, I basically did the uh, uh, what would you call it story mode, and that got me through to I think level 18 before I lost my lives. That was just one guy. That's a good one. Like all these all the breakout games, you want to uh, well, that was the red ones. Uh, not bonuses, they're, um, they're the ones that will hurt you. Now I've lost the ball over to the side there, look, it's coming back there. Ah, the, the mystery, the mystery was a, uh, was a, 
was a bad one. Yep, I'm trying to avoid that bad one. Ah. Missed that ball. Oh, two bad ones. Nothing for it really. That's it. Oh, missed. Missed. That was unfortunate. So there are some interesting levels where you have to hit like bumper pads to uh, make the blocks appear. Yeah, I didn't beat my high score, look. High score 1100. Well, there's also a magnet, which you uh, haven't seen yet. Let's see if I can find one of the bumper pad ones. I think it was this one, but I could be wrong. Um, let's do this one. I'm not in high score any yet. All right, so this is as far as I got when I played it for 45 minutes. Yeah, here we go. These are bumper pads, right? So, see the bumper pads drop the blocks. So you have to first get the blocks to uh, appear. And only then can you start removing them. There's another interesting level where you have... Uh, you have a bat at the top and at the bottom. And the ball can go out of either end. I found that one quite hard, hard work. In fact, I use it three lives. Get through that one. And then there are other levels that are actually uh, fairly straightforward. Just in general. That's an electric bonus, uh, electric piece of blocks, which is a... Uh, means you can affect them at a distance. Ah, it's very hard not to pick up pick up the um, bad the red things they, they sort of swerve towards you and stuff and uh, I think also the, the uh, detection ah lost a life there Action seems to be weighted towards giving you the bonus, or as it turns out, the uh, oh, this could be good. Or, or the penalty. It's quite hard not to. Uh... Oh. All right, so I've nearly got through. I've nearly got all the box out now. Actually, right. Can I hit that bumper? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. So electrocute some blocks. Okay, well this one does like a shield. I need to hit that last bumper pad there. Go on. Did I hit it? There we go. I'm going to clear this level, set on your high score, although not in story modes. So yeah, so it's a fairly cute game, it's 25% uh, it's off for the minute. It's new level record, so I think less than a fiver I paid for it. Uh, if, you, if you used to love Arkanoid back in the day, or uh, even more recent versions, I think this is well worth checking out for the money, even if it's, you know, it's a, it's a simple game at the end of the day, but it's quite fun. I quite like it. Uh, quite like these sort of games. Grey cubes. Uh, cheap. Fun. Uh, reasonably interesting for that sort of game. Check it out.